Alrighty, back to the game. So basically I was in the process of perplexing up Iron Man's defense to an 18 impervious. And then I was going to give my turn back to uh, Team Loki. Okay, so um, so Aim Agent is going to perplex up Loki's defense to a 19 with shape change and super senses. So that's going to be something. That's going to be one thing to hit. Okay, um... Now, in this game, with the power shove, you can shove as many people as you have targets. So if you have three targets, you can shove three characters, and the same rules apply for, um, for all of them. I'm wondering if you should split up the damage. I'll work that out later. But it doesn't matter because Loki has one target. Okay. So I'm going to move Loki up. I'm going to move him right there. I'm going to base Captain America since he has charge. Okay. Now, you know what? I'm going to move here. I have phasing teleport. But that means I can't be perplexed. Mm. What a conundrum. Um... Hmm, okay, I, hmm, this is interesting. You know what, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to stay here, see what happens. All right, we're going to do that, and we're going to clear these two. Um, yeah, okay, uh, let me see. All right, it's Team Iron Man's turn. Okay, so I'm based with Captain America. Now. Well, not really. I have phasing teleport, so, you know. Um, I'm going to perplex up Iron Man's damage to a 4. I'm going to attack him. No, wait, I should perplex his attack up. I'm going to perplex his attack up to a 12, and I'm going to attack him. Uh, that's 12 on a 9... No, that's an 18 now, because uh, he can no longer be perplexed. He's not in range. The machine is blocking him. 12 on 18, gonna need a 6. Uh, that's Snake Eyes. Captain America takes one unavoidable damage. Wow, what a... That was bad. That was not good at all. So now he only has 2 damage. That's interesting. I'm going to roll leadership to see if I can take a token off of Iron Man. Nope, didn't get it. Okay, um, what else can I do? I guess I have to clear. Coulson can attack, but it'd be a miracle. If, not really a miracle, but it'd be something if he hit him 9 on an, on an 18. Shape. Why am I even rolling attacks for Captain America? I didn't roll shape change yet, but he failed, so we'll, we'll let that go. Um, well, I mean... Well, if I'm going to do something, I better just put him here so that he can, you know, at least help out his buddies. I'm going to do that. Okay. Um, yeah, so I end my turn. Um, wait, any perplex? No, I don't think so. I mean, I have perplex, not, but no outwit. Okay, no outwit. What does he have for a damage power? He does not have outwit. Okay, just wondering. Uh, okay, so now it's Team Loki's turn. <clears throat> I'm going to move Aim Agent behind the machine. I use seven. One, two, three, four, five. Right there behind the machine. Okay, we're getting places. Okay, I'm going to... I have a damage... A four. Um, now, I cannot attack Coulson, but uh, did I agree that this was an attack or not an attack? I don't think this should be an attack because no dice are being rolled. So I'm going to push Coulson. Um, I have a range of four, and I'm right in front of him. So I can push him four spaces and cause him damage. So I'm going to do that because he'll take falling damage. One, two, uh, three, four. So he's here now, and he takes one falling damage, I believe. 
Which I think if someone falls off of a building like that, they probably take more than four damage, but whatever. Okay. We're good here. Uh, so that's so he is Loki has used his push token and until he makes another successful attack. I may want to modify that in the future. Uh, he cannot get it back. He still has his token. Okay, so and now what attack am I going to make? I'm gonna perplex up Loki's defense against again to a 19. I'm going to roll an attack on this cursed machine. Uh, let's see what happens. Um, I'm going to roll one die, and I score a hit, so that's one damage. So that means I have four to go. That's something. Okay. All right. Yes, that counts as an attack. All right. Um, so that's good. We have, we're, we're good here. Uh, let's see, what else can I do? I can do something with Calendar Man. I should probably bring him out because... Uh, um, and I have to get rid of Captain America. He could just repair the machine. Um, let me see what I can do with... Uh, I should probably bring Calendar Man out. He's, uh, he's going to be important. So that's three I can... Uh, then, but then I'm in range of... Iron Man. I gotta move Iron Man. Gotta do some crowd control here. Alright, so I'm going to give up give it up to Team Iron Man. See what's going to happen. Uh, I think they all have to clear. Let me see, do, does he have leadership? He has leadership. I'm going to roll leadership. Does not get it, so we all have to clear. Okay. These two have oh, I should have moved Calendar Man. Oh man. I really am my own worst enemy, aren't I? Uh, okay, now I shouldn't move Calendar Man because, uh, you yeah. know. Okay, so let's see. So, Iron Man has a has a shove token, so I could shove Loki into a wall and cause him some damage there. Um, let's see. Oh, but I have to move Iron Man first. Yeah, I could do that. Um, let me see. I don't think shoving should cause the same kind of damage as force blast. So I'm gonna just say, if you shove someone into a wall, they do, they do not take damage unless, like, it's over like four spaces you push them or something like that. But if you fall off a building, you automatically take one damage. Okay. Or you know what? This is a game. I, I'm not sure. Let's just go with one damage for now. I'm gonna move Iron Man here. I'm going to push Loki, I have, I'm going to shove Loki, not push, push is already a term, I have four damage, I'm right in front of him, so boom, into the wall, he takes a click of unavoidable damage for getting pushed into a wall, okay, and now I'm going to take a power action to try and repair the machine, so since Iron Man has the scientist keyword, I believe. He will not have a risk of damaging the machine. He can only repair it or not repair it. So let's see. He does not repair it. He's, we still have some extensive repairing to do. And that counts as a power action. So the machine only has, uh, let's see, 80% of its life left. Okay. Because well, uh, Captain America has just has cleared. Oh, I should have done that last, you see. Wait a minute. No, it cleared last turn, so now he can do something. So what should I do? Uh, I have charge, right? Yes, I do. I'm going to charge on the aim agent. I'm going to lock with him. And I'm going to hit him with a 10 attack on a 15 toughness. So I need a 5. I got snake eyes again. What is it with you and snake eyes, man? You've been gambling? You've been going sneaking off to Atlantic City while I wasn't around? What you doing, man? What's going on? An addiction can be a horrible thing, Mr. America. But, you know, why am I bothering to tell you that? Anyway. <laughs> Let me see. Okay, so that... 
gets... Oh, so that's... He still gets this for missing. Okay. Wow, you're safe for now. I better get rid of Captain America before he hits my aim agent.